Cheshire, archaically the County Palatine of Chester, is a historic county in northwest England. It is bordered by Merseyside and Greater Manchester to the north, Derbyshire to the east, Staffordshire and Shropshire to the south, and the Welsh local authorities of Flintshire and Wrexham to the west. Cheshire's county town is Chester, while its largest town by population is Warrington. Other major towns include Congleton, Crewe, Ellesmere Port, Nutsford, Macclesfield, Nantwich, Northwich, Runcorn, Widnes, Wilmslow, and Winsford. The county covers 905 square miles and has a population of around 1 million. It is mostly rural, with a number of small towns and villages supporting the agricultural and other industries which produce Cheshire cheese, salt, chemicals, and silk. It is split into the administrative districts of Cheshire West and Chester, Cheshire East, Halton, and Warrington. Cheshire's name was originally derived from an early name for Chester, and was first recorded as Legisister Seer in the Anglo-Saxon Chronicle, meaning the Shire of the City of Legions. Although the name first appears in 980, it is thought that the county was created by Edward the Elder around 920. In the Doomsday Book, Chester was recorded as having the name Cestrashire, derived from the name for Chester at the time. A series of changes that occurred as English itself changed, together with some simplifications and elision, resulted in the name Cheshire, as it occurs today. Because of the historically close links with the land bordering Cheshire to the west, which became modern Wales, there is a history of interaction between Cheshire and North Wales. The Doomsday Book records Cheshire as having two complete hundreds that later became the principal part of Flintshire. Additionally, Another large portion of the Duddeston Hundred later became known as Mailer Saes Neg when it was transferred to North Wales. For this and other reasons, the Welsh language name for Cheshire is sometimes used. The strategic location of the Earldom of Chester, the only county palatine on the Welsh marches. Pura Walia lands gained by Llewellyn the Great in 1234 Marsha Wally after the Norman conquest of 1066 by William I, dissent and resistance continued for many years after the invasion. In 1069 local resistance in Cheshire was finally put down using draconian measures as part of the harrying of the north. The ferocity of the campaign against the English populace was enough to end all future resistance. Examples were made of major landowners such as Earl Edwin of Mercia, their properties confiscated and redistributed amongst Norman barons. The earldom was sufficiently independent from the Kingdom of England that the 13th century Magna Carta did not apply to the Shire of Chester, so the Earl wrote up his own Chester Charter at the petition of his barons. William I made Cheshire a county palatine and gave Gerbeau the Fleming the new title of Earl of Chester. When Gerbeau returned to Normandy in about 1070, the king used his absence to declare the earldom forfeit and gave the title to Hugh de Vranche. Because of Cheshire's strategic location on the Welsh marches, the Earl had complete autonomous powers to rule on behalf of the king and the county palatine. Hundreds hundreds of Cheshire and Doomsday Book. Areas highlighted in pink became part of Flintshire in Wales. Cheshire in the Doomsday Book is recorded as a much larger county than it is today. It included two hundreds, Addiscross and Existan, that later became part of North Wales. At the time of the Doomsday Book, it also included as part of Duddeston Hundred the area of land later known as English Mailer in Wales. The area between the Mersey and Ribble formed part of the returns for Cheshire. Although this has been interpreted to mean that at that time South Lancashire was part of Cheshire, more exhaustive research indicates that the boundary between Cheshire and what was to become Lancashire remained the River Mersey. With minor variations in spelling across sources, the complete list of hundreds of Cheshire at this time are, Attiscross, Bukalau, Chester, Dudestan, Existan, Hamestan, Middlewich, Ryston, Roalau, Toondoon, Warmundestru, and Wylaveston. Feudal baronies There were eight feudal baronies in Chester, the barons of Kinderton, Halton, Maulbank, Mould, Shiprook, Dunham Massey, and the honour of Chester itself. Feudal baronies or baronies by tenure were granted by the Earl as forms of feudal land tenure within the Palatinate in a similar way to which the King granted English feudal baronies within England proper. An example is the barony of Halton. One of Hugh de Vranche's barons has been identified as Robert Nichols, Baron of Halton and Montabor. North Mersey to Lancashire in 1182, the land north of the Mersey became administered as part of the new county of Lancashire, resolving any uncertainty about the county in which the land in Turripam at Mersum was. Over the years, the ten hundreds consolidated and changed names to leave just seven, Broxton, Bucklow, Edisbury, Macclesfield, Nantwich, Northwich, and Wirral. 
Map of Cheshire in 1577. In 1397 the county had lands in the March of Wales added to its territory, and was promoted to the rank of principality. This was because of the support the men of the county had given to King Richard II, in particular by a standing armed force of about 500 men called the Cheshire Guard. As a result, the king's title was changed to King of England and France, Lord of Ireland, and Prince of Chester. No other English county has been honoured in this way, although it lost the distinction on Richard's fall in 1399. District through the Local Government Act 1972, which came into effect on April 1, 1974, some areas in the north became part of the metropolitan counties of Greater Manchester and Merseyside. Stockport, Altrincham, Hyde, Dukenfield and Stalebridge in the northeast became part of Greater Manchester. Much of the Wirral Peninsula in the northwest, including the county boroughs of Birkenhead and Wallasey, joined Merseyside as the Metropolitan Borough of Wirral. At the same time the Tintwistle Rural District was transferred to Derbyshire. The area of South Lancashire not included within either the Merseyside or Greater Manchester counties, including Widnes and the County Borough of Warrington, was added to the new non-metropolitan county of Cheshire. District and Unitary Halton and Warrington became unitary authorities independent of Cheshire County Council on April 1, 1998, but remained part of Cheshire for ceremonial purposes and also for fire and policing. A referendum for a further local government reform connected with an elected regional assembly was planned for 2004, but was abandoned. Unitary as part of the local government restructuring in April 2009, Cheshire County Council and the Cheshire Districts were abolished and replaced by two new unitary authorities, Cheshire East and Cheshire West and Chester. The existing unitary authorities of Halton and Warrington were not affected by the change. The ceremonial county showing the four unitary authorities. Click on the map for more information Cheshire has no countywide elected local council, but it does have a Lord Lieutenant under the Lieutenancies Act 1997 and a High Sheriff under the Sheriff's Act 1887. Local government functions apart from the police and fire-slash-rescue services are carried out by four smaller unitary authorities, Cheshire East, Cheshire West, and Chester, Halton, and Warrington. All four unitary authority areas have borough status. Policing and fire and rescue services are still provided across the county as a whole. The Cheshire Fire Authority consists of members of the four councils, while governance of Cheshire Constabulary is performed by the elected Cheshire Police and Crime Commissioner. Winsford is a major administrative hub for Cheshire with the police and fire and rescue headquarters based in the town as well as a majority of Cheshire West and Chester Council. It was also home to the former Vale Royal Borough Council and Cheshire County Council. From April 1, 1974 the area under the control of the County Council was divided into eight local government districts, Chester, Congleton, Crewe and Nantwich, Ellesmere Port and Neston, Halton, Macclesfield, Vale Royal and Warrington. Halton and Warrington became unitary authorities in 1998. The remaining districts and the county were abolished as part of local government restructuring on April 1, 2009. The Halton and Warrington boroughs were not affected by the 2009 restructuring. On July 25, 2007, the Secretary of State Hazel Bleers announced she was minded to split Cheshire into two new unitary authorities, Cheshire West and Chester, and Cheshire East. She confirmed she had not changed her mind on December 19, 2007 and therefore the proposal to split two-tier Cheshire into two would proceed. Cheshire County Council leader Paul Finlow, who attempted high court legal action against the proposal, claimed that splitting Cheshire would only disrupt excellent services while increasing living costs for all. A widespread sentiment that this decision was taken by the European Union long ago has often been portrayed via angered letters from Cheshire residents to local papers. On January 31, 2008 the Standard, Cheshire and District's newspaper, announced that the legal action had been dropped. Members against the proposal were advised that they may be unable to persuade the court that the decision of Hazel Bleers was manifestly absurd. The Cheshire West and Chester Unitary Authority covers the area formerly occupied by the city of Chester and the boroughs of Ellesmere Port and Neston and Vale Royal. Cheshire East now covers the area formerly occupied by the boroughs of Congleton, Crewe and Nantwich, and Macclesfield. The changes were implemented on April 1, 2009. Congleton Borough Council pursued an appeal against the judicial review it lost in October 2007. The appeal was dismissed on March 4, 2008. Cheshire covers a boulder clay plain separating the hills of North Wales and the Peak District. 
This was formed following the retreat of Ice Age glaciers which left the area dotted with kettle holes, locally referred to as Maris. The bedrock of this region is almost entirely Triassic sandstone, outcrops of which have long been quarried, notably at Runcorn, providing the distinctive red stone for Liverpool Cathedral and Chester Cathedral. The eastern half of the county is Upper Triassic Mercia mudstone laid down with large salt deposits which were mined for hundreds of years around Winsford. Separating this area from Lower Triassic Sherwood sandstone to the west is a prominent sandstone ridge known as the Mid-Cheshire Ridge. A 55-kilometer footpath, the Sandstone Trail, follows this ridge from Frodsham to Whitchurch passing Delamere Forest, Beeston Castle and earlier Iron Age forts. The highest point of the historic county of Cheshire is Black Hill, near Crowden in the Cheshire Panhandle, a long eastern projection of the county along the northern side of Longdendale, and on the border with the west riding of Yorkshire. Within the current ceremonial county and the unitary authority of Cheshire East the highest point is Shining Tor on the Derbyshire-Cheshire border between Macclesfield and Buxton, at 559 metres above sea level. After Shining Tor, the next highest point in Cheshire is Shutling's Low, at 506 metres above sea level. Shutling Shoe lies just to the south of Macclesfield Forest and is sometimes humorously referred to as the Matterhorn of Cheshire thanks to its distinctive steep profile. The Cheshire Plain from the Mid-Cheshire Ridge. Greenbelt Cheshire contains portions of two Greenbelt areas surrounding the large conurbations of Merseyside and Greater Manchester, North Cheshire. Greenbelt, part of the Northwest Greenbelt, and Stoke-on-Trent. These were first drawn up from the 1950s. Contained primarily within Cheshire East and Chester West and Chester, with small portions along the borders of the Halton and Warrington districts, towns and cities such as Chester, Macclesfield, Alsager. Congleton, Northwich, Ellesmere Port, Nutsford, Warrington, Poynton, Disley, Neston, Wilmslow, Runcorn, and Widnes are either surrounded wholly, partially enveloped by, or on the fringes of the belts. The North Cheshire Green Belt is contiguous with the Peak District Park boundary inside Cheshire. Borders the ceremonial county borders Merseyside, Greater Manchester, Derbyshire, Staffordshire and Shropshire in England along with Flintshire and Wrexham in Wales, arranged by compass directions as shown in the table. Below. Cheshire also forms part of the Northwest England region. Based on the census of 2001, the overall population of Cheshire East and Cheshire West and Chester is 673,781, of which 51.3% of the population were male and 48.7% were female. Of those aged between 0 to 14 years, 51.5% were male and 48.4% were female, and of those aged over 75 years, 62.9% were female and 37. 1% were male. This increased to 699,735 at the 2011 census. The population for 2021 is forecast to be 708,000. In 2001, the population density of Cheshire East and Cheshire West and Chester was 32 people per square kilometre, lower than the northwest average of 42 people slash km2 and the England and Wales average of 38 people slash km2. Ellesmere Port and Neston had a greater urban density than the rest of the county with 92 people slash km2. Population change in 2001, ethnic white groups accounted for 98% of the population, and 10,994 in ethnic groups other than white. Of the 2% in non-white ethnic groups, Wilmslow Church in the 2001 census, 81% of the population identified themselves as Christian. 124,677 did not identify with any religion or did not answer the question. 5. 665 identified themselves as belonging to other major world religions, and 1,033 belonged to other religions. The boundary of the Church of England Diocese of Chester follows most closely the pre-1974 county boundary of Cheshire, so it includes all of Wirral, Stockport, and the Cheshire Panhandle that included Tintwistle Rural District Council area. In terms of Roman Catholic Church administration, most of Cheshire falls into the Roman Catholic Diocese of Shrewsbury. Cheshire has a diverse economy with significant sectors including agriculture, automotive, biotechnology, chemical, financial services, food and drink, ICT, and tourism. The county is famous for the production of Cheshire cheese, salt and silk. The county has seen a number of inventions and firsts in its history. A mainly rural county, Cheshire has a high concentration of villages. Agriculture is generally based on the dairy trade, and cattle are the predominant livestock. 
Land use given to agriculture has fluctuated somewhat, and in 2005 totaled 1,558 square kilometers over 4,609 holdings. Based on holdings by EC farm type in 2005, 8. 51 square kilometers was allocated to dairy farming, with another 11. 78 square kilometers allocated to cattle and sheep. A resident of Nutsford sanding the street in celebration of May Day in 1920 the chemical industry in Cheshire was founded in Roman times, with the mining of salt in Middlewich and Northwich. Salt is still mined in the area by British salt. The salt mining has led to a continued chemical industry around Northwich, with Brunner Mon based in the town. Other chemical companies, including Ineos, have plants at Runcorn. The SR refinery is at Ellesmere Port. The oil refinery has operated since 1924 and has a capacity of 12 million tons per year. Crewe was once the center of the British railway industry, and remains a major railway junction. The Crewe Railway Works, built in 1840, employed 20,000 people at its peak, although the workforce is now less than 1,000. Crewe is also the home of Bentley Cars. Also within Cheshire are manufacturing plants for Jaguar and Vauxhall Motors in Ellesmere Port. The county also has an aircraft industry, with the BAE Systems facility at Woodford Aerodrome, part of BAE Systems Military Air Solutions Division. The facility designed and constructed Avro Lancaster and Avro Vulcan bombers and the Hawker Siddeley Nimrod. On the Cheshire border with Flincher is the Broughton Aircraft Factory, more recently associated with Airbus. Tourism in Cheshire from within the UK and overseas continues to perform strongly. Over 8 million nights of accommodation and over 2. 8 million visits to Cheshire were recorded during 2003. At the start of 2003, there were 22,020 VAT registered enterprises in Cheshire, an increase of 7% since 1998, many in the business services and wholesale-slash-retail sectors. Between 2002 and 2003 the number of businesses grew in four sectors, public administration and other services, hotels and restaurants, construction, and business services. The county saw the largest proportional reduction between 2001 and 2002 in employment in the energy and water sector and there was also a significant reduction in the manufacturing sector. The largest growth during this period was in the other services and distribution, hotels and retail sectors. Cheshire is considered to be an affluent county. However, towns such as Crewe and Winsford have significant deprivation. The county's proximity to the cities of Manchester and Liverpool means counter-urbanization is common. Cheshire West has a fairly large proportion of residents who work in Liverpool and Manchester, while the town of Northwich and area of Cheshire East falls more within Manchester's sphere of influence. All four local education authorities in Cheshire operate only comprehensive state school systems. When Altrincham, Sale and Bebbington were moved from Cheshire to Trafford and Merseyside in 1974, they took some former Cheshire selective schools. There are two universities based in the county, the University of Chester and the Chester campus of the University of Law. The Crewe campus of Manchester Metropolitan University was scheduled to close in 2019. Lewis Carroll Memorial Window Cheshire has produced notable musicians such as Rick Astley, Ian Curtis of Joy Division, Harry Styles of One Direction, the members of the 1975. Gary Barlow of Take That, Ian Asbury of The Cult, Van McCann of Catfish and the Bottleman, concert pianist Stephen Huff, John Mayall of John Mayall and the Blues Breakers, and Tim Burgess of the Charlatans. Oxford-born singer Thea Gilmore resides in the county with her producer husband Nigel Stonier, who is a Cheshire native. Actors from Cheshire include Daniel Craig, Tim Curry, Pete Postlethwaite, Wendy Hiller, and Lewis McGibbon. The county has also been the origin of several acclaimed writers, including Hall Kane, Alan Garner, Elizabeth Gaskell, and most famously Lewis Carroll, who wrote Alice's Adventures in Wonderland and named its Cheshire Cat character after the county. Artists from Cheshire include ceramic artist Emma Bossens and sculptor-slash-photographer Andy Goldsworthy. Local radio stations in the county include D106. 3. Capital, Smooth Radio, Silk FM, Signal 1, Wire FM, and Wish FM. It is one of only four counties in the country, along with County Durham, Dorset, and Rutland, that does not have its own designated BBC radio station. The south and parts of the east are covered by BBC Radio Stoke. While BBC Radio Merseyside tends to cover the west, and BBC Radio Manchester covers the north and parts of the east. The BBC directs readers to Stoke and Staffordshire when Cheshire is selected on their website. There were plans to launch BBC Radio Cheshire, 
but those were shelved in 2007 after the BBC license fee settlement was lower than expected. The Royal Cheshire Show, an annual agricultural show, has taken place since the 1800s. Cheshire has been home to numerous athletes. Many Premier League footballers have relocated there over the years upon joining teams such as Manchester United FC, Manchester City FC, Everton FC, and Liverpool FC, which are all located nearby. These include Dean Ashton, Seth Johnson, Michael Owen, Jesse Lingard, and Wayne Rooney. The Golden Triangle is the collective name for a group of adjacent Cheshire villages where the amount of footballers, actors, and entrepreneurs moving in over the years led to the average. House prices becoming some of the most expensive in the UK. Other local athletes include rock climber Shauna Coxey, cricketer Ian Botham, marathon runner Paula Radcliffe, oarsman Matt Langridge, hurdler Shirley Strong, sailor Ben Ainsley, cyclist Sarah Story, and mountaineer George Mallory. Cheshire has also produced a military hero in Norman Cyril Jones, a World War I flying ace who won the Distinguished Flying Cross. Cheshire has one football league team, Crew Alexandra FC, which plays in League One. Chester FC, a Phoenix club formed in 2010 after ex-football league club Chester City FC was dissolved, competes in the National League North. Northwich Victoria FC, another ex-league team which was a founding member of the Football League Division II in 1892-1893, now represents Cheshire in the Northern Premier League along with Nantwich Town FC. Warrington Town FC, and Witten Albion FC. Macclesfield Town FC formerly played in the National League, but went into liquidation in 2020. The Warrington Wolves and Widnes Vikings are the premier rugby league teams in Cheshire, the former plays in the Super League, while the latter plays in the Championship. There are also numerous junior clubs in the county, including Chester Gladiators. Cheshire County Cricket Club is one of the clubs that make up the minor counties of English and Welsh cricket. Cheshire also is represented in the highest level basketball league in the UK, the Barrel, by Cheshire Phoenix. Europe's largest motorcycle event, the Thunder Sprint, is held in Northwich every May. As part of a 2002 marketing campaign, the plant conservation charity Plant Life chose the cuckoo flower as the county flower. Previously, a sheaf of golden wheat was the county emblem, a reference to the Earl of Chester's arms in use from the 12th century. Buildings and structures of Cheshire from top left to bottom right, Nantwich High Street, Crew Town Council, the Wizard Pub, Chester Rose, Capesthorne Hall, Little Moreton Hall, Beeston Castle, Eden Hall, and Chester Cathedral prehistoric burial grounds have been discovered at the Bridestones near Congleton and Robin Hood's Tump near Alpram. The remains of Iron Age hill forts are found on sandstone ridges at several locations in Cheshire. Examples include Maiden Castle on Bickerton Hill, Helsby Hilford and Woodhouse Hilford at Frodsham. The Roman fortress and walls of Chester, perhaps the earliest building works in Cheshire remaining above ground, are constructed from purple-gray sandstone. The distinctive local red sandstone has been used for many monumental and ecclesiastical buildings throughout the county, for example, the medieval Beeston Castle, Chester Cathedral and numerous parish churches. Occasional residential and industrial buildings, such as Helsby Railway Station, are also in this sandstone. Many surviving buildings from the 15th to 17th centuries are timbered, particularly in the southern part of the county. Notable examples include the moated manor house Little Moreton Hall, dating from around 1450, and many commercial and residential buildings in Chester, Nantwich and surrounding villages. Early brick buildings include Pover Hall near Macclesfield, Tattenhall Hall, and the Pied Bull Hotel in Chester. From the 18th century, orange, red or brown brick became the predominant building material used in Cheshire, although earlier buildings are often faced or dressed with stone. Examples from the Victorian period onwards often employ distinctive brick detailing, such as brick patterning and ornate chimney stacks and gables. Notable examples include Arley Hall near Northwich, Willington Hall near Chester and Overly Lodge, Chester. From the Victorian era, brick buildings often incorporate timberwork in a mock Tudor style, and this hybrid style has been used in some modern residential developments in the county. Industrial buildings, such as the Macclesfield Silk Mills, are also usually in brick. Warrington Chester Stockport Birkenhead Crewe Shaw Ellesmere Port Runcorn Wallasey Witness Sale Macclesfield Altrincham Winsford Hyde Wilmslow Cheadle Hume Congleton Bramhall Marple Stalebridge Nutsford Northwich Notable Places in Cheshire, Red Towns Historically in Cheshire, Orange The county is home to some of the most affluent areas of northern England, including Alderley Edge, Wilmslow, Presbury, Tarporley, and Nutsford, 
named in 2006 as the most expensive place to buy a house in the north of England. The former Cheshire town of Altrincham was in second place. The area is sometimes referred to as the Golden Triangle on account of the area in and around the aforementioned towns and villages. The cities and towns in Cheshire are, some settlements which were historically part of the county now fall under the counties of Derbyshire, Merseyside and Greater Manchester, bus transport in Cheshire is provided by various operators. The major bus operator in the Cheshire area is Arriva Northwest. Other operators in Cheshire include Stagecoach Chester and Wirral and Network Warrington. There are also several operators based outside of Cheshire, who either run services wholly within the area or services which start from outside the area. Companies include Arriva Buses Wales, Baker Bus, High Peak, First Greater Manchester, D&G Bus and Stagecoach Manchester. Some services are run under contract to Cheshire West and Chester, Cheshire East, Borough of Halton and Warrington Councils. Alderley Edge in 1951 The main railway line through the county is the West Coast Main Line. Trains on the main London to Scotland line call at Crewe and Warrington Bank Quay. Trains stop at Crewe and Runcorn on the Liverpool branch of the WCML. Crewe and Macclesfield are each hourly stops on the two Manchester branches. The major interchanges are, in the east of Cheshire, Macclesfield Station is served by Avani West Coast, Cross Country and Northern, on the Manchester-London line. Services from Manchester to the South Coast frequently stop at Macclesfield. Cheshire has 3,417 miles of roads, including 214 miles of the M6, M62, M53 and M56 motorways, there are 23 interchanges and 4 service areas. The M6 motorway at the Thielwall Viaduct carries 140,000 vehicles every 24 hours. The Cheshire Canal system includes several canals originally used to transport the county's industrial products. Nowadays they are mainly used for tourist traffic. The Cheshire Ring is formed from the Rochdale, Ashton, Peak Forest, Macclesfield, Trent and Mersey and Bridgewater Canals. The Manchester Ship Canal is a wide, 36-mile stretch of water opened in 1894. It consists of the rivers Irwell and Mersey made navigable to Manchester for seagoing ships leaving the Mersey estuary. The canal passes through the north of the county via Runcorn and Warrington. List of rivers and canals Cheshire 8 Wikipedia's sister projects. Thanks for watching.